guest and lovely welcome back in the kitchen again with Chef Ricardo cooking show it's amazing to be in the kitchen anyway I just want to give you a simple recipe I want to do some shrimps I'm gonna do a french fried shrimps and I'm gonna do it Chef Ricardo way all right if you're allergic to egg flour please don't use it okay guys all right first thing I must say I'm going to be talking about the Jamaican Valley season that's the season which I'm going to be using on it um, this is the fish season and that's what I'm going to be using so first thing let's get the fish season off the market right here I'm just gonna just remove this piece of the lid of the fish season um, this is some shrimps roughly a pack of shrimps roughly uh, probably 500 grams of shrimps I believe something like that I don't remember but um, this is the shrimps I wash it off into some lemon juice clean it up and remove the shell fresh and nice ready again first thing we're going to do is to get the Jamaican Valley this is the fish seafood season and I'm going to put a, a large tablespoon of it and also I have a cup of plain flour right here I'm gonna pop roughly one large tablespoon of the Jamaican Valley fish season like that. so let's put this one side so this is all right out of the way this is the Jamaican Valley jerk season we're going to use some on it also just to bring in a lovely spicy flavor to it so I'm gonna put one tablespoon and I'm gonna put also a tablespoon of it on the flour lovely and nice white as a chef Ricardo boy you're the best in the world yes um, this is a Jamaican Valley all purpose season what I'm going to do I'm going to pop half tablespoon of it and half tablespoon on the flour lovely must say I have some this is some dry chili I'm gonna pop a pinch of dry chili and I'm gonna pop some straight in the flour just like that lovely and nice all right second things guys I'm gonna say to you um I have some garlic right here two cove of garlic which I'm going to be using um, but not only that I'm going to pop a little bit of paprika just a little bit of paprika on it and also a pinch of paprika on the plain flour so the same thing on the, on the shrimps is the same thing on the plain flour and that will just bring in a lovely flavor so alright so I got two cups of garlic what I'm going to do I'm just going to be grating the garlic on my little grater right here and that's more easier this is really handy to use to grate a garlic but the only thing you have to just be careful because you don't want to cut yourself when you're going to grate your garlic but it's really 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 easy and simple much easier when you remove the garlic you don't have to stress yourself to cut up the garlic you know so what I'm going to do now is let's remove off the garlic like that and the garlic come out a little bit more finer you can do all of it, even white onion anything you want to do with it you can do the same thing what I'm going to do I'm going to pop a little bit of oil not too much just a little pinch I already don't know it's going to be mixed up in oil second thing make sure you have a gloves gloves is very important what I'm going to do is just put on a gloves and marinate up the prawn the shrimps like this sorry guys so this is how it look so that look nice and lovely yeah this is exactly what me I talk about right here nice and lovely then after you do that a lot of people doesn't know you know what I mean a lot of people doesn't know that um, also you can egg wash it if you like to you don't have to egg wash it if you're allergic to egg but it's this chef ricotta recipe and chef ricotta ideas give it a try what I'm going to use is use a fork and use it to sieve up the flour together with the season everything all right in the meantime if I'm what you need to do is to make sure you put on a medium-sized fried pan on the stove let the oil start to get hot it's very important guys all right so what we want to do now is crack two eggs or at least one egg but with enough or two eggs it's up to you 
but for me I'm gonna just use two egg all right so I'm gonna crack two eggs cuz the more egg is the better for it lovely and nice then after you do that you can put on back a gloves or something I can just use it and it doesn't matter but now just giving you my recipe what I want you guys to see then what you're gonna do is simple us bang 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 yeah and dip it back into the flour into the egg wash again bang and flour it just like this you don't have to dip it back if you don't want to but you know what I mean it's just chef record recipes and ideas and what you're gonna do just egg flour them up now put them into the flour and then we'll be all right like that and we're gonna do all of them like this into the flour can we all know that anything you, you, you flour you, you put egg on and you know what I mean and fry it definitely come out different does you know what I mean no matter what you do you know it's always going to be coming out really totally different um, what I would do when I flour them I'm gonna pop them on a plate like this and like this you know that's I can just take them off and fry them down more easier that's then doesn't get lost so we're gonna do the one of these now and as I finish we're going to fry them all right guys nice and lovely so guys as I can see I just finish just just finish with these shrimps just flour them off and egg wash them and now we're going to deep fry them all right so as i can see the way they're looking so lovely and nice the only thing you need to do now is deep fry and so they come out lovely and nice all right guys so enjoy the recipe as it goes along nice and lovely so remember earlier i said to you you need to have a medium-sized frying pan on the stove make sure the eyes start to get hot all right so what we want to do now we want to pop a few nights and see all right so this is exactly what you want to see happen and you don't want to put too much in there to, for it to get, you know what I mean? Because you want to have it all on a real good perfect temperature for it to fry them really lovely and they come out really nice. As you can see exactly what's going on right here. Take a look at time and fry them. This one is a little bit big. And the center, it smells really nice. And as it goes along, all I have to do just turn it over to the other side and turn it over to the other side because you don't want it to get burned and then get black and ugly you want it to have that perfect color all right and not only that you can serve this with some sweet chili sauce as you can see looking lovely already see this is exactly what I'm talking about. Something different, you know what I mean? And there's many different kind of ways you can do them. You can do them even by making a thick sauce like a butter sauce and fry them in it. But that's another process. We can do that another time. And I use a good Jamaican valley season. And you see what the thing is, they doesn't take long to fry. Okay, you know what I mean? These doesn't take long to cook. You know what I mean? Shrimps is very easy to cook, guys. And you don't want to overcook them and then, you know, you just want to have them perfect. And they're looking so lovely and nice. Once the oil is hot perfectly, you're good to go. In the meantime, you can put another two more. These ones can come out. And all I'm doing at the moment is put them on a piece of a grease proof paper just to get rid of the grease. Nice and lovely, so basically. This is the last set.
Just turn them over. Really nice and simple and lovely. It's just something different, you know what I mean, guys, where you can do at home. So as soon as this fry, we're gonna set them out and share you, show you how they look on the plate. Nice and lovely. So right here, this is how they look on the plate. They finish, and now I'm gonna put them. I just put them on a piece of a napkin to get the rest of the grease, some of the oil from it. All right, guys. So they finish, and now I'm gonna show you how they look on the plate. Nice and lovely, guys. So basically, as you can see, this is the shrimps right here, and you know. I just finished my shrimps and come out lovely and nice and honestly guys you can do the same thing at home and it come out lovely you can have it with sweet chili sauce and also with salad at the side thank you so much for watching chef for show that a lot more recipes a lot more ideas will be coming for you and I will see you next time bye bye